Good morning, new vlog, mechanic day. Come on, love, get up. Time to do some vlogs today. So I'll start this vlog and I'll give this um, thing away. First bit, this mag tame thing, this cable. What we were giving away. So I'm on my computer and. Who am I talking to? I'm talking to a camera. Are you vlogging? Yeah, to me it was that one, wasn't it? Well, I did say what it was called, and it was a Magtem. Magtem, Magtem. Comments with a word, pick a winner. Okay, user such and such. Who's that? Rach and Dave, user such and such. Anyway, Rach and Dave, whoever you are, get on Facebook, drop us an inbox with your address and confirm who you are and uh, we'll get it uh, posted out to you. Alright, first job at day. Just found a sticker in motor home. York's the finest pair. Some more YouTubers. Done. Next job. Right. Empty this thing. We need room. So we've been selling scooters. Our last scooter's been sold now. So I've just got mine out. Put it on charge. And uh, let's get this for sale. Because it's not needed no more. It's freezing as well. So if anybody's interested in this scooter, it is for sale. Just drop us an email. Gonna be wanting about 700 quid, 800 quid for it. It does do about 30 mile an hour plus. Um, I can't remember what I've had out of it. I think I've had about 40 mile an hour out of it myself. It is fast and it goes up in hills, and I mean hills with me on it at 20 stone. And the bat rip, it lasts all day. So, the reason we're getting rid is because I need room in here. We've never got any room. And we never hardly use these scooters. So, time to get rid. So, we've got the mechanic coming today. Well, this morning. Well, they said he was. And he's going to hopefully fix this step. Hey, hey Pews on Tour YouTube family, if you're loving the content, here's a quick reminder to hit that subscribe button and, and leave a comment. comment. Your support means the world to us. Fix an headlight bulb, which all this, all this, all has to come out just to put a silly bulb in. And then my horn needs fixing and all this has to come off to get to on, which is on the right hand side, I think. I'm not sure. But I'm sure we'll find out in a little bit. If he turns up. Well, he ain't got out of bed yet. Because he's still in it. Walking the mile. Walking the mile. Peasant shower block. I've never used them showers yet. I use them at motorhome. Wash your hair. What are you doing? Stop using all my power. I'm only your powers. Alright. Oh, Can you stop recording me? I'm not even dressed. Get away. Oh. <laughs> anyway, if you want all powers, believe it or not, link in the description, big discounts, 
Crack on. The more you click, the more discounts we give. They might be able to wait, or I've turned it off. Yeah, oh yeah. Now, can you I think recording? they did anyway. Stop recording, do me yeah. The first and only time people will see my hair done. <laughs> I can't put bobble in it today. Was it a fake laugh? So. I don't know you dare calling me with fake laugh. That looks really nice, you know. The sky. Get dressed. Oh, headlight bulbs getting done. Headlight bulbs getting done. Get outside and show. It might take him four hours to strip front end down. Oh, he's oh, he's getting took to pieces. One bit off. Another bit off. <laughs> That's what it looks like at the moment. Just to get to an arm, it's still going with another paddle. So this panel, has to, he has done the headlight now, which is good. One horn. Off. Some job quid this, because of that plug. So, ordered a cheap ass one. Found them as on seven quid. So, I'll just change the ends to uh, spades. Get away from the edge, you'll be squashing Jay under there. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want me to bolt it for you, love? Yeah. No, more bullying. Mary's bullying me. Mary's bullying me. Ta da! <laughs> You're not going to leave what he did. Jay, charging eight pa £80 an hour. Right, it took him three hours to take screws out of the bottom of it. He sprayed some WD-40 and it bloody worked. <laughs> so, headlight fixed, step fixed. Just ordered a new horn, uh, which will be coming via, via Amazon tomorrow. So, that can get put on. I can't believe it took the front end off. Look at my front end. Front end off, and it'll stay off until tomorrow. Amazon will come, new on, get it on, get it fitted, beep beep, we're all done. I can't believe it, we just some WD-40. So guys, exactly what was wrong with the step is, there's a switch on the outside of the step. And what had happened, it looked, well basically sprayed some WD inside the switch and started prodding the switch. So it looks like some muck or some sand got in there. So if that ever happens guys, get some WD or something inside the switch, which is on the show of everything. So all the muck is spraying to the switch. So if it ever happens, spray it and it should work. If not, order a new switch which is £32, brand new, is a switch online. But I'm not going to order one, because uh, it's working. You're doing your next job. Huh? You're doing your next job. What's that? Toilet needs emptying. Oh, have you filled it again? Like, like you don't use it? No. I've just cleaned the bedroom. All your mess. All your mess. All the empty cig wrappers that's side at bed, you scruffy ass. Not cig poppers. Poppers? Wrappers. Papers? No, the plastic around the sleeve of cigs when you open it, you just throw it, it's outside of your bed. No, it must have fell down there because yeah. they're in there, my sleeve of cigs. Yeah. I brought my last packet. But, I just get my shit emptied. <laughs> Need a hazmat suit for yours. <laughs> I'm cleaning. Clean this? No, I'm not doing that. Do you want some Domestos to get a proper rinse out? I'll give it a right good clean. I did it yesterday actually. Alright, okay. Go on then, get on with it. Blue job, blue job. So, I'm just going to show you Gareth and Jay. <laughs> um, he's helping Jay do his awning. Divorcing a bag. Oh. 
now it's sunny I would be out there laughing at them up close but I am cleaning I've almost done my kitchen I've done my bathroom and I've done my bedroom I'm just going to do my living area you dirty put stuff bitch away, and then I'm going to go see how far they've got <laughs> Gareth and his green string he's always measuring something with green string I just want to come on and do a quick shout out Celebrity to News Stuart and Carol Gilson thanks for all your lovely messages it really means a lot and also it's a weird one Lisa Worrell I owe you a sticker. Right, I can't find your address anywhere. I've looked on the pews on tour. I've looked on mine. I know I owe you it, it's written in my book. But I can't post you out because I don't have your address. So if you could get in touch, Lisa, <laughs> on the pews on tour, or get us or mine, Facebook, drop us a message. I need your address, my love, so I can get you posted out. Thank you. <laughs> I know it's only been a couple of days, but do you want to draw this? Because I've got some other stuff to post and I'll post it today. Yeah. If you give me a word can do. Name. Uh, so I'll do that live as well then. I did want to begin in this video as well though. Oh did you? <coughs> Magtain video, but we'll do it. Um, we did say we'd comment and say Freddy. Yeah we did. There's a few mixed Freddies in these comments. It has to be IE, I'm afraid. Yeah, it is. Uh, Freddy. His real name I. is Freddy. F. Well. Do you know his real name? Before oh, he changed Sarah. it. I remember his last name is Bulsara. I can't remember his first one. It's somewhat Bulsara. Yeah, if anybody knows it comments. Oh, I can't think it's going to kill me now. Without Googling it, I can't remember. <laughs> his last name is Bulsara. Yeah. I'm a Freddy fan. Right, right so it is Freddy with IE. So, on the computer. Oh, have you got it ready to go? Yeah, I've just put it in Freddy with an IE. Pick a winner. We've got Avon Higgs, 7562. And there's a message, get well soon, Gareth. Freddie. So? Yvonne Higgs, well done. Get in touch, give me your address and I'll push you out, my love. Uh, Facebook, inbox or email. Yes. Both links are in the description if you don't know where we are. Yes. Well done. <laughs> So our lass has gone to the uh, MRI for a checkup. So we've got to hang around for an hour. I ain't got a clue what I'm going to do for an hour. I suppose I'll have to eat my chips. And. Uh, when she watches this video, she's gonna kill me. But love, I got, I got a whopper. Who it all the pies? Who it all? You fat butt. So while you're uh, in the MRA, getting your uh, checkup, I'll uh, sit and enjoy my dinner. Oh, and I got a coffee as well. No wife to tell me that I can't have it. Her perchumer is bigger than mine. It's like a competition, isn't it, between us? Tumor twin one and tumor twin two. Like a competition all the time. Finished. I better go get rid of evidence before I uh, pick her up. Rubbish gun. Hello. Hi, this is Corinne from the CT department. Your partner has just finished her CT scan. She's just telling me to ring you. Oh, uh, can you pass a message for, to her for me? Yeah, of can, course. Can you tell her I've left her and I've gone to Australia? Is <laughs> <laughs> gone to Australia? <laughs> <laughs> Are you coming back in or do you want yeah. her to meet you anyway? Tell her I'll meet her at entrance. I'm just leaving Costa up road. Okay, he'll meet you at entrance. Which entrance? When, when I dropped her oh, off. Where? Okay, no problem. Thank you. Alright, thanks. Bye. I guess I've got to go for her. Alright, catch you in a bit. I'm back. Some Judas went to Costa without me. <laughs> it's all right, you did it last time. <laughs> so, 
I was in a bit longer than expected because he moved. My June was he's moved. I called him a him because it's annoying him. Blood's are annoying, aren't they? So my tune has moved a little, so they called me back in and I had some contrast, which was nice, so they didn't call me a different day. So, I don't know. All I know is it's moved. It's not in the same position it was in last time. Has it gone on holiday before we have? <laughs> yeah. So I says, does that mean he's grown? She was like, I don't know. All I know is he's moved. Um, but So she's taken more with contrast where they put a dye in you. I sent it off. My she said, I'll leave from my specialist in a few weeks. Which means I left from a specialist in about 10 years. <laughs> so, yeah, we're going to go to Aldi now, aren't we? Or Lidl, whichever. I know there's one of them in Beverly, I just don't know which one it is. I'll let you know when we get there. What do you think? I think it's a Lidl. I know it does pretzels. Yeah, that'll do. Don't be long putting that shopping away in boat in rain. <laughs> don't forget to put shopping trolley back. Well done in the rain. Do everything, me. Uh, the bloke behind the counter in Riddle, by the way, has got some really, really important news to tell you all, okay? He's just found out Costa have got a drive through So I just thought I'd tell you all. Don't know. He was like, the Costa here in opposite Lidl has got a drive through It's the first one ever in England. Gareth was like, no, it's not. I was like, what are you talking about? Every, all Costas have got a drive through unless you're in the city centre, mate. I was like, God, I'll leave him alone. He didn't know. Uh, and and if it helps you, it was from Newcastle. So everybody watching from Newcastle, <laughs> I hope you are all... Uh, uh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> bless him, he was a bit simple. I think he was just fickle. I know. <laughs> I never knew Costa, you know what I mean? <laughs> no, you was proper trying to tell us that, <laughs> that Costa in Beverly is the first ever Costa drive through weren't they? Yeah. So you picked on him, because that'd be me. So, remember guys, don't all go at once because it's a drive through it's, don't make it public notice on Facebook because it'll go silly. <laughs> you know what I mean? And the, everybody, it'll just catch on and everything will start being a drive through <laughs> Do you know what I wish was a drive through mm. My fucking marriage. Yeah, that's it. You put shopping away. Come on, please talk. I've been real busy. Shop. Just put shopping up floor and then open the door. Just come and open the door. My hair's in my face. I'm keeping this door open so you don't blow up, get blow up, closed. Open this door. Oh my god, I have to do everything today. Pink job. So, afternoon campers. Can you see him in the background? So, we had a call from the hospital. Someone's coming to see Gara. Well, they want him in to see him. And we was like, when? She was like, I've just come across your case now. So, we've just come home from work. <laughs> I'm going to get changed. Thank the Lord for pits and bits leaving conditioner so my hair doesn't smell like bacon butties. I'm going to have a wash, get changed and we're going to go to the hospital. I'm going to try and take you with me. Let's find out what's going on with him today, people. We're on our way to hopefully get some results, aren't we? Yep. Hopefully. It's good luck, you know. I'm going to try and film you in the hospital as well. Try and slyly film you. You can film yourself. So, we'll you just see. Got to point the camera upwards. So you can all see up my nose. <laughs> Basically, yeah. See, if you've got your nose waxing like I did. Well, thank you. What way? Oh. Oh. We have to walk around the key thing. <laughs> we have to walk around the barrier. Look at him frowning. You've got frown lines in his head. They're going to be permanent now. He's had a day that long. These frown lines, are, I believe, are never going to go away. Living with you. <laughs> No, to do with living with me. I'm like, it's like it's like a piece of cake living with me. It's like a holiday every day. We're all right for parking for three hours. I mean, you better not be in there three hours, I'll cry. We've been at this hospital before. Why? Why? That tooth that sticker there matches your t-shirt, love. <laughs> he's in. Oh. Look where he's going first. Are you, are you going to cost her, love? It's going to cost her. Are you happy now? Decaf coffee. You happy? Yeah. <laughs> I get decaf, I've got a caramel latte. 
go in. <laughs> Isn't that many? <laughs> I told you to bring your inhaler. Never listens. And it should say medical outpatients, turn left. Love and welcome at the reception. Thank you. You know who you are. Don't move again. We've been here 30 seconds. Thank you to the girls on reception. Just like you, the YouTubers. Hi. Thanks for being so polite and friendly and nice. Just saying this. Fourteenth of May. If anybody's got gut problems, Kim, Cameron. Tuesday, fourteenth of May, the Guild Hall. You can go and speak to the stomach specialists. And do they have got an inflatable colon? Colin, the inflatable colon shows you what the inside of a bowel looks like. Kim, I think you should definitely go learn some information about Cameron with his bad stomach. And anybody else who wants to go, I kind of want to go meet Colin, the inflatable colon. I'm not gonna lie. It's a smelly shit job, but somebody has to do it. <laughs> that was a right dad joke. Really quickly before two she comes back in. Gareth's going to have two injections in back of his head. Yeah. They won't let me record it. So hopefully that'll take the pain off. She's back and going. Want to tell them what you've had done then? Yeah, I've had two injections in back of my head here. In here. What and was the, there? Your nerve blockers stop some nerves here and goes all the way down. They've injected there, so everything above here. Hopefully in a few days has no response or pain whatsoever. That's it. Thank you very much, girls, for the hospitality. Thank you very much. It was really good of them. They did a really good job. So thank you. And thank you to the doctor that just did it. So I was really quickly after speaking to you yesterday. Really appreciate it, guys. And I'm talking to them like the watchers because the watchers got the told us. <laughs> so the other day we did a review of this, uh, what do they call it, Benin's plug and play. Basically, stick it in your stereo and you can watch YouTube, Netflix and all sorts. If you want to know more about it, just go back a video or two and watch the review of it. Uh, and if we're going to give it away. So if you want this, uh, just type in the comments, Benin's, Benin's, whatever it's called. And we'll draw it out in an, another video next week sometime. Oh, by the way, from Eustace's Inject from hospital as well. I don't have that silly migraine. It's just a normal headache at the moment. I can cope with that. So hopefully these injections are going to work. So how long did doctor say we've got? She says she contacts me in a week or so. Yeah, going to check me up on me in a few weeks and see how it goes. And in about an hour's time, the postman arrives and I can get me home. But it is raining, so I don't know if he's going to fit it today. So hopefully we will be away next weekend. Can't wait. So we will catch you on the next one. Because I think you've got enough on this video. We're going to start this questions and answers video next, I think. So we'll knock that one out as well. Catch you on the next one. Oh, by the way, from Eustace's injections, from hospital as well. I don't have that silly migraine. It's just a normal headache at the moment. I can cope with that. So hopefully these injections are going to work. So how long did doctor say we've got? She says she contacts me in a week or so to no. see how they're doing. No. I know she's going to check up on you in a couple of weeks, right? Yeah, she's going to check up on me in a few weeks and see how it goes. And in about an hour's time, the postman arrives and I can get me home. But it is raining, so I don't know if he's going to fit it today. So hopefully we will be away next weekend. Can't wait.